amazing. Awesome. How have you been? I've been good. How have you been? All good. It's been. It was great to see you last to last year. You know, pre-COVID, it was good to see you yeah, in Dubai. That, was, that was when. That was like two years ago. Two thousand nineteen, right? I think. Yeah, Savi. Yeah, that was. Yeah, that was a while back. Two thousand nineteen. Yes. yes. COVID took over and messed up everything. <laughs> Oh my god! And it's still, and it's still really, really, really bad in Bombay, in Maharashtra. So okay. We have a night, so we have a night curfew going on, which is you can't be outside after eight o'clock. So it's still very oh. dangerous here. Okay. Yeah. But now, because I see films are constantly postponing and delaying. That's the since today morning. Constantly, yes, absolutely, and that's so sad because you know, just people are too scared to go to the movies now, and. I mean, it's good for people on OTT because everybody's just sitting at home and watching shows. So that's when well, we all get to watch you. You're keeping us busy, all of us. <laughs> yeah, right. <laughs> Which is amazing, great. But well, thank you so much for coming in today and accepting the invitation. Thank you very much thank for that. You. And uh, thank you for I've having got, me. Thank you. I've got tons of fan questions. I know we have limited time, so I'm going to try and do it as easy. Perfect. Pellet, okay. obviously, we would like to uh, congratulate for Beka Butu is doing really well and a lot of praises. And of course, after Thank season you one, so much. Good. Yeah. So we'll start with our question answers. Um, so Priya, uh, for the people who don't know, of course, most of us know everything about you. But Jonay Jante, how did your acting journey start, or how did you know that okay, this is what I want to do? Ah, oh, it's a long story. Yeah, my acting journey. I didn't. Uh, I never grew up thinking that you know I'm going to become an actor. I, okay. uh, you know, that was never a part of my plan. I graduated with like you know marketing masters in marketing. So I've done my university in Canada, and I was um, quite sure that I'm going to do something in Canada. You know, I never thought I'd live mm. in India. So um, I don't know how it happened. A friend of mine was in this course in active repairs, and I always wanted to travel India. So okay. she was like, "Why don't you, you know, sign up? You'll get to, you know, learn acting." And I was already uh, doing pageants and stuff in Canada. I was Miss World okay. Canada photogenic. So okay. I'd won, I'd won a title there, and I was doing a lot of TV show hosting. So I was always liked being in the limelight and entertaining people. You know, that was always there. Wow. Okay. So when uh, this, my friend suggested this, I was like, "Oh, you know, why not? This is a great um, idea. I get to travel India, and plus, you know, mm -hmm. I get to do something I like." So then I got into active repairs, and uh, I remember there was some audition, and I loved loved the journey of you know learning the craft and everything. And then I remember there was an audition happening for a South film, and I got a okay. message, "Would you like to test for it?" And I said, "I don't even know Telugu. I don't speak the language, so I don't know how I would even you know it's pointless." But exactly. I always you know did the audition for fun. There was some over a couple of hundred, three, four hundred girls who had auditioned for it, and I remember. Oh I, wow! I okay. got it. I remember going wow. back to Canada. I packed up everything, went back to Canada. I remember I got a call saying, "You know, you've been uh, selected, finalized for this cast, for the lead." And I was like, "What?" Like I didn't even do the dialogue <laughs> in Telugu. I did it in English and Hindi. So I don't know what went <laughs> on, but you know what? I guess. Um, And that's how it started, you know. Then on set while shooting, being in front of the camera is when I realized that this is what I want to do because this I just, what I want. I enjoyed all of it. I don't I'm think sure. if I ever, I don't think if I didn't get that movie or if I wasn't a part of a film or I was in front of the camera, I don't think I would realize that this is what I want to do, you know. Because I'm sure that's what made me realize. Because we used to shoot for some sixteen, seventeen hours and. I never felt tired. I just loved it so much, and I was like, you know, mm -hmm. if you have to do a job you love, mm -hmm. it's it doesn't feel like work at all. And that's when I was like, okay, this is it. I'm going to India, and I want to be an actor. And that was my realization. Wow! And with your good looks and just amazing the way you your fit. I mean, seriously, I think you just you. you're just doing wonders. Wow! <laughs> thank, you, thank you. Amazing. Um, so, how different was Bekabu two from Bekabu one? After you know, season with me, and you were very much. A very strong character, and Bekabu comes somewhere revolves yeah. around you as well. So, how different did you yeah. feel? One, two from one. Uh, I don't know if you've seen both of them, but two is the continuation of one. So, if you don't yes, see the season one, you don't really understand season two. Will not make sense. You know, it's yeah. just a bunch of things happening. But mm -hmm. if you see season one, how Kashti and Anisha, you know, they kind of got together. Exactly the three characters, yeah. Because uh, he was this writer who used. Kashti's sister, to you know, mm -hmm. as a bait. 
so okay. this time he comes back because hmm. you know his life got all ruined and fame and money yeah. all that he wanted was taken away from all him by these girls, girls just girls just took away everything <laughs> yeah so he comes back and then he starts taking his revenge also season 2 is all about his revenge on uh, anaisha and kashti yeah so, so in i this think season, uh, you get to see kashti a little more less like not crazy you know in season 1 she was acting all crazy and yeah, like right. kind of he's more in love this <laughs> yeah so this one this one you see more a real version of her where she's you know enjoying a cafe she has of her own she's chilling exactly so she's hmm. in a different zone now, a more realistic zone in this true yeah. okay awesome uh what makes priya so wake up <laughs> i know mine's getting hanged i am with if you're there thank you for connecting both of us again i know right <laughs> <laughs> So even Taha, I mean, how was it working with Taha? You guys are really good friends. So Taha and I have been friends for a very long time. I think almost about six, seven years now. So I've known the guy for a while. So I didn't know he was going to be opposite me, uh, my playing my boyfriend. And I remember hmm. he called me and he's like, "Hey, guess what?" I'm like, "What?" He's like, "Guess who's <laughs> playing Novin?" And I'm like, "Who?" He's like, "Me." And I was like, "What?" So you know, oh. playing in a show where there is a little bit of intimacy and there is a little bit of um, all of that, you know. If for mm. I think I got both of us say this, including Taha. I hope you know he feels, and he said mm. said it out in his interviews that he's yeah. lucky I was a co-actor, and I'm glad he was because you're already so comfortable with each other, your friends. Like we used to laugh, like we had our intimate scenes and we used to sit and laugh, like we used to literally <laughs> laugh and action and cut and the director was like, guys, get serious, like what is this? So we because we had that comfort zone, you know. I'm I'm glad that it was him. That it was a piece of cake. It wasn't awkward. It wasn't weird. You know. So yeah, yeah. it's easy. And you guys look fabulous and hoping to see you both again maybe in movies and more serials because you make a fantastic pair and I think you guys look oh, so good. Oh, yeah. Hopefully. So what sure. makes uh, Priya Bekam? Sorry? What makes Priya Bekam? I've said this in many times in many interviews because people always ask me this and man there is always <laughs> food. food 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 and food. And where is the food? <laughs> I so skinny. All my friends say this to me. I honestly, I mean, I'm a runner. I like running and all, but okay. uh, I eat. I eat a lot. I mm. can out eat any guy in front of me. Like even I have had guy friends who are like, "How did you just finish that?" Like, <laughs> Where is all? Oh, to, especially when it comes to biryani. Oh my oh, goodness! Yeah. Oh my god! Nobody should watch it. It is unattractive. It is not attractive. <laughs> Watching me eat is not attractive. You're like, you stop eating now. Like, what is wrong with you? I know. But yeah, I love it. all the girls out there. Khaa ke bhagna shuru karo. Burn it up. I swear to God, I don't understand the concept of uh, dieting. Mujhse nahi ho payega. Like, I cannot uh, count my calories. I mean, of course, I believe in eating healthy. Like, I believe you must have your greens. You must have your fruits for your skin, for your hair, all of that. But if you really genuinely feel like you want to eat something, I feel like you should listen to your heart and, <laughs> and then work out after you know, take care. Like you want to stay exactly. fit, yeah, yeah. Chale, I'll quickly go to the fan questions. There were so many fan questions, and while like inbox right. and stuff, you don't want to break their heart. So you can probably have quick answers. So um, okay, which celebrity did you have a fan girl chance or fan girl like? Who are you crazy about? Aisha. Shahrukh Khan. Shahrukh Khan. Okay. Yep. <laughs> okay. Um. This is from Devika. What is your favorite makeup product, and what do you recommend? You know, I'll be very honest. I don't really wear much makeup. Like even right now, I don't have any base or anything. I have a little bit of blush. I love blush. So okay. lately, my favorite uh, product is that Benefit uh, Coco Tint that you get. It's okay. So it's so nice. I just dab it on my cheeks, nose, and on upper. Oh, the eye. tint. Yeah. It's a tint and my lips, and I rub it off, and that's it. Like I, that's all I do. And I. But then you have genetically skin. nice skin too, right? So. <laughs> I thought as a Bengalis, you know, have that. I think it's because my exactly. mom forcefully feed me fish when I was a kid, and I hated her for that. Then now I'm like, thank you. Thank now you you're like beautiful. Yes. Uh, Ravi, what's your favorite Snapchat filter? If you do use. I don't use Snapchat. I have a lot of Instagram filters, though. But okay, uh, which one's your favorite from Insta? Or you would be surprised how many filters I have because I keep stealing. You know how you can steal filters from people when they share something, 
And yeah. I keep paying people's filters and I was like, oh, this is nice. And then I keep saving. Nice. So I have at least good like 25, 30 filters that I've stolen Whoa. from people on Instagram. <laughs> but I have many, I have plenty. Like I many. love Instagram filters. And they will really like, fresh as your face. Okay. Kashi, right? what is your dream role? Oh, my dream role. I There's so many. I mean, honestly, I've, uh, luckily, I've gotten to play a lot of uh, women driven, sh- like, you know, characters. And if you've seen Twisted, or if you see even Big yeah, I've seen one, or Rain, or whatever it is, the, all the characters have played a very strong women characters, like even Barry, yes. like, you know, all the characters have been very, they know what they want, very strong headed. So for me, women driven films or shows have always been an inspiration, like, uh, a queen that Kangana did or fashion that Priyanka did, you know, like uh, Mary Com okay. that, yeah, Mary Com that Priyanka did, you know, like it's a lot of hard work but then it's a really okay. strong female characters. So mm-hmm. for me, a challenge is something I'd always want to take up. Like I don't want to keep doing the same things. Thanks again. Awesome. Yeah. Um, okay, Abdullah, if you were to be stuck in an elevator, who are the three people you would like to be stuck with? Actors or just anybody? Anybody. Up to you. Or you can probably actors to make it fun. You can say. Yeah, I mean, actors. if I say anybody random, people yeah. be like, who are they? You know, right? Actors. Um, <laughs> Shah Rukh Khan. Whoa. Uh, Brad Pitt. Okay. Uh, and uh, Ranveer Singh. Why not? Ranveer. Great. I think we all want to be in that elevator with you now. <laughs> You right. Right. Wow. Okay. Uh, Zishan, who who's your favorite Marvel DC hero? Oh my God, uh, Iron Man. Any day. Iron Man? Any day. Robert okay. D- Downey Jr. Uh, in fact, I keep watching Avengers all the time. Hmm. Yesterday, I was watching Avengers. Henry okay. Cavill, wait, wait, Henry, su- uh, oh, Henry Cavill. Henry Cavill is Superman, but he's not DC Superman, I think. Okay. Uh, so Iron Man for you. Iron Man any day, like. I have, anyway. a, I have a thing for old. I have a thing for manly men, you know, like a okay. little older and classy, Old. and you know, like yeah. so. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> awesome, um, Shazen. What's your favorite color? Hmm. Many. I have plenty of favorite colors right now. Currently, is blue. My couch and everything in my house is blue. Uh, I love. I love uh, black and white, but they're not colors actually. Yeah. Uh, red. I'm a big fan red. of red. And, like and it really suits you. Because I've seen you wear red in the web series and you just stand out. It looks really nice on you. Yeah, I think that's why I like red because I think people like me in red. So I think, mm, okay, <laughs> can be my color. It does suit you. Uh, okay. Um, who's on your wish list to work with, Yana? Uh, Bollywood. 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 Yeah, Bollywood. Shah Rukh Khan? Okay. I think Shah Rukh Khan is in every <laughs> center. Just, he's he's I have one wish list that is just his name written on both letters. <laughs> and I, hopefully that should happen really soon. Okay. Um, you you played a okay a cunning character in Twisted or a strong character. Have you ever encountered that in real life? Yeah, koi aisa moment hai where you're like, no, you know, you are a go-getter in that. Yeah, I mean, I wouldn't call her cunning. Um, uh, Myra's character in Twisted, she's somebody who. Uh, She's in a corporate world, and corporate world is a man's world. And not only corporate, I think most of the places, I think everywhere, places, yeah. it is a man's world. So mm. to, for her to reach on the top, the way men she, initially she wasn't like that. It's not like yeah. you want, you know, like that. Exactly. You want she was to deceived for then, her to turn that way. Yeah. yeah, and you realize how people use you and walk all over you. For her, if then she realized that for me to get on the top, I have to do the same with men. You know, mm. so that's just a very ambitious woman so for me yeah. um, sorry what was the question that is uh, did you ever encounter or were you did you ever have a I moment where you had to be uh, her in real life you know like no, I, I mean I want to say cunning I'll probably say go-getter or uh, like you said I am, I am definitely a go-getter but I would say that not to that extent like Myra like killing people and all no, I mean, I don't know <laughs> <that. laughs> Series and I, I thought it was so wow and different, you know, because to pull off that role entirely on you was just amazing, you know. I, I personally, watch thought, it? I watched it. I have. Yeah, yeah. I watch all your series by you because okay. I'm a little by I don't know what's your what's your star. What's my your story? Story? 
Your my horoscope. My horoscope is Aries. My birthday is coming up in two weeks. 16th. Oh, how sweet. Okay. Advance happy birthday. So I'm a Leo. So you know when, you know, how oh, Leo and Aries stuff. get along together. Yeah. That's that's why. Why. Aggressive, you know, and I kind of when I see that I'm like that's a powerful role because I can't see you in a bichari role. I don't know. I can't I visualize. I haven't. It. I haven't till date. I haven't uh, played where I'm like you know like sad. Exactly. And, you know, yeah. Like I don't want to play a damsel in distress. You know, I mean, that's a exactly. very a clear choice I've made with all the shows I've done. Hmm. Which which is yeah. amazing. Um. Okay. Any chance of seeing you in Big Boss Fifteen? Vina. <laughs> you know, I don't have anything against Big Boss. I think it's very entertaining, but I don't think I'll be entertaining enough in Big Boss because I just don't think. I mean, I'm competitive when it comes to work and stuff, but for games and funny things like that, I'll probably sit in the yeah. corner and watch people, you know, and then I'll get watch eliminated. People. So it's pointless. <laughs> they'll be like, hey, "There's no TRP because of her. She she's too quiet." Yeah, they're like, "What if we are doing sitting in the corner and laughing at people?" <laughs> Awesome. Um, you did a movie with Karan Veer. How was your experience, Zoya? I've done a movie and I've done a show called Bhavan with him, which okay. Was, yeah, we actually shot that in lockdown. So uh, yeah, KV. I've known KV for a very long time. Again, since I've been here, because uh, the film that I shot with him was one of the first films that I shot. Uh, so he's a great friend. I know his family really well, and it's just you know, you people you've known for a long time. They're like family. Exactly. I don't know if you remember. I did the promotion for Hamid Tum Se Pyar Kitna in Dubai. I was the agency here. Oh yeah. You oh, you yes. did send me a yes. shout out. Yes. 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 I remember that. I remember that. Yeah. That that movie. Even the song. Uh, the title song uh, got an award. Shreya Ghoshal got an award for it. So the song did yeah. really well. So that's great. So hopefully we should want to see you in movies also. Do some more movies as well. Right now, movies. Have, I'm glad there's no. I know the situation. Out. I think we're seeing is obviously safer, but yeah, 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 for sure. If someone had to be Priya, um, okay, I'll rephrase it. I guess if somebody had to live Priya's life for a day, what are they expecting? This is from Priya. What are they expecting to do? Uh, as in, if a Priya ki zindagi jeene ho, so how would that be? If I'm if I'm working, then of course, uh, depending on my call time, early or late, you know, get ready for shoot. I usually mm-hmm. try and squeeze in a little bit of run. If it's a lot, I mean, the last few days are too full, which happens to me a lot. <laughs> um, I tend to wake up early by five six if I'm shooting in the morning. Okay. And uh, run for at least half an hour, forty minutes. I do that. I shower and then I go to shoot. And then again, you know, depending on the shoot schedule, long day, short day, really depends on the producer directors. uh and then yeah you come home i like to unwind i like to watch a you know maybe a couple of episode of a show or mm-hmm. like you know eat dinner and then mm-hmm. sleep very simple very chilled out very yeah. chilled out simple okay yeah the party yeah. no party no friends no hangouts so. i have a lot of uh, close friends uh, not a very social i used to be a very social person but then i think uh, Post your mid twenties, you tend to be like, uh, exactly. like you know, I, when you know, I'm in that phase where I like being home. I'm I'm a complete homebody. Like oh. I prefer sitting at home, watching something, you know, making some food. You know, that makes me happy. So I like staying at home quite a bit. Okay, awesome. Um, do you prefer movies or web series, Rahul? Movies any day. I think for me, just the whole. uh experience of sitting in front of the big screen you know watching a movie in the big screen it's always going to be i i don't think anything can beat that you know that whole uh i don't know that i don't know the the way you feel when you especially when you watch like a movie like a devdas or a sanjay meela bansa you cannot watch those movies on your tv you know or even <laughs> in, in on a big screen at home that has that is a theater experience you know Exactly. So, so Rahul say yada he's a very big fan of yours and he wanted if you could just give a shout out for him I remember he asked me okay his birthday is coming up Rahul Yeah Rahul hi mm-hmm. Rahul um well thank you for being a great fan keep watching my stuff and happy birthday in advance I'm not sure when his birthday is yeah. but whenever it is he just the person Awesome, thank you, um, Sabha. Would you, uh, if given a chance, would you play a character like Sri Ruhi, like a horror comedy? Absolutely, I think that would be super fun. Again, very. Uh, I think you do fantastic. Uh, <laughs> right, I think I would love to do something like that. Like you know, something because that would be challenging to convince people that you are possessed or you're a ghost. 
exactly. I, mean, I would love to do horror. I love watching horror, so I would hopefully someday I'll get to do some horror. Stuff. I know that would be just awesome. I would love to see I a know. horror as well, and uh, with oh the God, strong I mean, Nathan character it, that I love. I love. <laughs> You would be too good at it. Okay, Mani. Uh, being working with regional industry, do you see any challenges in Bollywood? No, I mean, uh, you know, films or shows in any platform are pretty much. I mean, in any language, it's the same process. Mm. The, the okay. work process, the shooting process. Other than the language, everything mm. else remains very similar. And okay. for me, because okay. I knew Hindi from before, Hindi was I was more comfortable in Hindi. So learning uh-huh. Telugu and Tamil was a little bit of a challenge for me, but working in Bollywood was much easier because of the much easier because I because I relate to Hindi a lot more. Yeah. Okay. Awesome. Um, Sophia, who is your favorite Bollywood? Okay, you said Shah Rukh Khan. Put chord ke I guess any of them together. Chalo female. Yeah, Who's your favorite I, I, female? I think I think um, Shah Rukh. Yeah. It's okay. In case I've got a girl, who's your favorite female actor? Girls, I like Karina a lot. I just love the way she is, and I also love Priyanka. I think Priyanka and Karina would be my two favorites. Wow. Um, okay. Last question. I'll take off the fan. What difficulty did you face when breaking into the industry, Faisal? Huh. I mean, it's being in the industry itself is a constant struggle in the sense for everybody. You know, I'm I'm not just saying about newcomers or even established actors. Because you you are as some this is a very good quote that I believe in you're as good as your last release right so if you last release it didn't do well then you know it's always gonna no matter it could be a Shah Rukh Khan for example you know for him mm. if his past five films or three films didn't do well he is yeah. going to be stressed about it, even though he's such a massive star so I think exactly. uh, it's being an actor being a director being a producer in this industry it is a constant struggle you never really. Reach that bit of satisfaction. It's always going to be a hard work. It's always so. I think for me, it's very important to enjoy the moment when you're working. Like right now, if I'm doing a show, I want to absorb all I can from that and enjoy mm-hmm. living in that. Uh, so yeah, I don't really look too far or too much in the future. I try to enjoy as much as I don't see anything as a struggle. I just see it as a learning experience. But the job is here. Let's just concentrate on that. Yeah. True. Yeah. Yeah. So if I have to ask Priya, what's next for Priya? What's coming up? What's in your kitty? What's your future projects? Well, uh, well not- in terms of a couple of things, again, I'm trying to be really picky this time, doing things that is again stands out and is very different from what I've done before. Um, so I'm not currently. I'm not shooting for anything, especially because of COVID. I've taken a break, and because okay. since July, I was shooting back to back, back to back, back to back, nonstop, and I've realized. I'm very lucky that I didn't get the virus exactly. yet. I don't know how. Maybe exactly. I did. Maybe I have antibodies. Maybe I should. Can't hope it. Chala bhi kya? Pata hi nahi chala. Pata hi nahi chala, right? Ho bhi sakta hai. So uh, who knows? But I'm a little scared right now. So I'm taking a little bit of a break and you know just chilling and promoting the shows and stuff. But you will see uh, more stuff coming up soon. Okay. I think you announced something on your social media yesterday. Eleventh uh, yes. hour. Yeah. Eleventh hour, yes. I'm playing a uh, role of a spy there again, very different from what okay. I've done. So, uh, yeah, I mean, you know, I like doing different things. I like exploring into different things. Something that I've not done before. I don't like repeating the same uh, characters and doing the same thing on this in different platforms. Awesome. Chalo, thank you so much, Priya. I think I'm done with your fan questions, and thank you so much for taking out time. I know you're running late, and uh, and all the best for your future events. And please, we want to see more stuff and more web series, and especially films. And we hope that thank you so much. One day, Shahrukh Khan and we, you will be on the same screen also. Aapke mo mein ghi shakar. Thank you so much. Really, I hope and I promote that. <laughs> Please, I hope I hope Shahrukh is watching this. <laughs> <laughs> I think we. I remember meeting him in Dubai. I I worked with so many stars. I've done about four hundred films. Shahrukh Khan could see me. I just couldn't control, and I went and I just you hugged did. him. There's this aura. You, there was some. I and usually I, I. You you met me. I'm very calm and composed. But I that day I'm like to hell with if I get fired. I don't care. <laughs> I need to hug this guy first. There's some real weird, amazing aura about this man that. He is around. You can sense it. It's he's just a star. Like you know, he's a real definition of a star. I think. Like he right. just has an aura about him. 
awesome so stay safe stay as beautiful as fred and look after yourself and thank you so much once again thank lots you. of fans have logged in if you want to say something to your fans bahut sara hi guys thank like. you for uh, logging in i mean i'm couldn't uh, speak to people directly here but thank you so much for logging in and watching this and uh, hopefully again we'll come on live sometime soon in, and inshallah. thank you for having me it was so much fun it's quick fun session was really i know nice. quick fun and oh, i think it was a like girly talk it's about time <laughs> right? it's, girl- it's always more yeah. fun when you interact with the women interact with women rather than with men because you know it's just it's just a different zone i feel right it's more right. fun and casual yeah more fun So perfect. Thank, Thank you so much. Please look after yourself. Thank you. Thank you too. Take care. Thank you. Bye. Bye. Bye.